bright souls thank you for joining me once again for another one of my YouTube videos this is week three on the Dr. Berg adrenal body type program status so I had an okay week it really wasn't that great um, it started off with me being sick on Sunday and Monday and I do my prep on Sunday my food prep for the week and I don't know if it was because I wasn't feeling well or what or if my recipes were a little bit off I'm not really sure but about 50% of what I made uh, tasted okay and the rest of it just really wasn't good <laughs> so I ate it you know I wasn't gonna waste it I made it and I ate it but I sure didn't enjoy my food this week I, I really just didn't enjoy it at all <sighs> but I am looking forward to the um, items that I have planned for this coming week and I am feeling better so hopefully I don't have a, a bad Sunday like I did last Sunday I did have um, some food cravings uh, this week, a couple of cravings, but they weren't uh, intense, uh, so I was able to resist. Um, but I did have some cravings, and I, I think it might have been because I just wasn't enjoying what I was eating, so I kind of like went back to that whole default mode where, you know, I wanted to snack on something familiar, or I wanted to eat something familiar that I know I would enjoy. I don't know if that's what prompted the cravings or if it really was you know physical instead of psychological um, because I wasn't feeling well I didn't sleep as well uh, I didn't wake as rested as I have been the previous two weeks so that could have something to do with it also uh, just it just wasn't a great week it just I had a fantastic first two weeks and this week was just okay um, some ups and downs but you know that's life right that's how it's gonna be I can't be you know rainbows and sunshine all the time <laughs> even though I do live in the sunshine state <laughs> um, let's see I was gonna back down on my fat intake um, because I was experiencing some gallbladder uh, pain and I mentioned that in in the in week two uh, update and I started out the beginning of the week, like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I didn't have quite as much fat, um, but that didn't work so well for me on Thursday and Friday. What I ate had more fat in it. So it kind of was a wash in the end. I didn't have much of a change in my ratio, my, my carb, fat, and protein ratio uh, this week over last week. So week two and three were kind of the same ratio. So my... Um, my carbs for week two was 45% and for week three it was 46%. My pro, uh, I'm sorry, uh, my fat was 40% for week two and 39% for week three. And my protein, 15% for week two and 14% for uh, week three. So there really, really wasn't much of a change. Um, one thing that I or actually I kind of figured out a couple of things so I had some meals that had higher fat in them and I didn't have that gallbladder pain and in one of my meals it was a salad and I had I think it was two tablespoons worth of um, pumpkin seeds and I got the gallbladder pain so I kind of narrowed it down to seeds and I'm gonna be soaking those um, pumpkin seeds, seeing if I can maybe sprout them, and maybe that would help. I'm not really sure. But I'm definitely not gonna have a meal where I have two tablespoons of, of pumpkin seeds, because that's too much. I'm kind of thinking I might keep my, my uh, fat grams per meal under 15 grams per meal maybe around 10, 11, 12 grams per meal. I'm not really sure, I haven't quite figured that out yet. I'm just sort of like toying with those ideas, trying to figure out what's the sweet spot for me. Um, but some of the higher fat meals that I had this past week uh, did not result in the pain. And then one where I had um, 
uh, pumpkin seeds, it did result in, in the pain. So interesting, very interesting. So yeah, like I said, I've got a whole new lineup planned as far as recipes go for this coming week. Pretty excited about them. I'm trying to do higher protein. So Dr. Berg recommends for the adrenal body type that your daily intake of protein is somewhere between 50 and 75 grams. And when I went back, I realized I really wasn't meeting that um, gram intake. So I'm going to be, uh, I've got it, I've got it planned. I don't know if, if I'll execute it in my recipes, but I'm going to try my best to hit the upper end of that um, ratio. I don't know what's going on with my little doggies. Mm-hmm. Daddy shouted at him. That's right. Oh yeah, I know what's going on. We have a new neighbor and they're having like, I guess maybe a housewarming or something. There's a whole bunch of cars and people walking by the house. That's probably what it is. Yeah, she doesn't, she doesn't like strangers walking across her front yard. <laughs> she's kind of protective. Uh, she's small, 11 pounds, but boy, she's got a big attitude. <laughs> anyway, um, what was I saying? Yeah, so I, I realized I wasn't, I was barely making the 50 grams per day. Um, so, you know, I'm like, being diabetic, and I'm really protective of my kidneys, I'm really scared of protein. So now that I've been on the program for like three weeks, I'm feeling more confident and, and I tr I'm trusting Dr. Berg more. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna step it up a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna go for the uh, closer to 75 grams of protein per day, definitely over 50. I'm gonna keep it between, between that uh, those two numbers that range so yeah I'm that's you know it's it's tweaking it's finding out what works for me at my health status and it's not static I mean you know over the coming weeks it's probably gonna change again as I figure things out as I learn what works what feels good you know that sort of thing so pretty pretty interesting pretty exciting I'm I'm pretty pleased so the results um, <laughs> oops, I forgot to do my blood pressure. Sorry. I can't tell you what that is. Um, I'm back on my blood pressure meds, like I've mentioned several times now, so I'm going to stop mentioning that. Uh, so I'm sure it's within the normal range, but oops, I forgot. Um, I lost one and a half pounds this week, so... I now weigh 209 pounds. My overall for the three weeks that I've been on the Dr. Berg Adrenal Body Type program is six pounds. So that's an average of two pounds a week. That's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. My blood sugar, oh yeah, <laughs> I'm so excited. Uh, so my blood sugar went down a total of 60 points this week week three was down 60 points but my total my overall total from day one on the dr berg program adrenal body type program to the end of week three so three weeks 209 points my fasting blood sugar this morning was 121 121 guys that is 21 points above normal I just need to come down another 21 points and I will actually have a fasting blood sugar that is within normal range seriously I can I cannot tell you I do not remember the last time I had a blood sugar reading that was within the normal range so 209 points it's fallen in three weeks isn't that a, incredible it really is it really is so i'm very hopeful very optimistic that um week four is going to have me achieve um 
a normal fasting blood sugar. 21 points, I think in week in my week four, that's that's doable. So yeah, pretty exciting, pretty exciting. Um, when I edit this video before I put it up, I'm going to take my blood pressure reading, so I will have that reading for you. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I was so excited to get in front of you, in front of the camera and make the video that I totally forgot to do the blood pressure reading. But I'm sure it's normal because like I said, I'm back on my meds. So I think that's everything that I wanted to share with you. Um, thank you for spending time with me. Uh, and I really do appreciate um, your encouragement, liking, subscribing, um, commenting, please. Uh, pretty please. <laughs> I'm like begging. <laughs> um, yeah, so have a fantastic week. Until next time, goodbye.